Welcome to Engineering Update, brought to you by Mauser Electronics, the electronic components distributor with the widest selection of the newest products. I'm Melissa Barnes, Associate Editor of ECN. In this week's headlines, electrically charged hydrogel for soft robotics, eSpider electric aircraft goes on sale for under 40K, and Aquatop display brings immersive entertainment to your bathroom. Researchers at Tokyo's University of Electrocommunications are exploring new territory in the field of natural user interface design. Their Aquatop display takes immersive entertainment to a whole new level with regular, impenetrable touch displays. Aquatop works by projecting images onto the surface of water in your bathtub. Mixed with bath salts, the water becomes milky white and provides better contrast as a projection surface. Opaque water also reflects the infrared light emitted by a Kinect depth camera, which is responsible for tracking the position of your fingers. Both the Kinect camera and the projector are connected to a single PC. Not only does the Aquatop display provide novel ways of interacting with multimedia, but it also makes for an immersive gaming platform. The gaming experience is further enhanced by a waterproofed speaker fitted to the bottom of a water tank. The speaker produces sound at a frequency of 50 Hz, while the water shoots upwards in a fountain accompanied by lights from integrated LEDs. Though the prototype is not meant for commercialization yet, it has demonstrated the potential of seamless user interfaces in one of the most unusual places. Electric aircraft company Greenwing International has announced the release of its first 50 eSpider single-seat electric planes, which will be sold as build-it-yourself kits for under $40,000. The eSpider is a compact flyer measuring 19.4 feet in length and 7.9 feet high with a wingspan of 33.1 feet. It is propelled by a 32 horsepower motor powered by a 13 kilowatt hour onboard lithium battery. Greenwing says that the eSpider's custom charging system monitors the health of the battery in order to achieve the best performance possible. Researchers at North Carolina State University have developed electrically charged hydrogels for use in the growing field of soft robotics, which finds its inspiration from squid and starfish. The Iona printing technique uses a copper electrode to inject positively charged copper ions into a hydrogel material consisting of copper and polymer. They then apply an electrical current which causes the hydrogel to flex. This technology allows the application of modest voltages to locally tune the mechanical properties of hydrogels in order to create flexible exoskeletons. The team is also currently investigating the possibility of biomedical applications such as artificial muscles, enviro-intelligent sensors, actuators, and biomimetic microbots. That wraps up this week's report. Be sure to join the conversation on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn, or email me your story ideas. I'm Melissa Barnes, and this has been your Engineering Update.